All right, so a few days ago, Nick Airball called Gare a nit, and today him and Nick Vertucci had a podcast where they talked for over an hour about how Garrett's a greedy player. And honestly, after reading Garrett's tweets and looking over his winnings from the Hustle Casino, it starts to make a lot more sense why players don't want him at the live stream. In this long tweet, Garrett says, I'm a professional poker player. My job is to ethically win at the highest rate I can. Poker is not a team sport. And in most cases, Garrett's probably right. But as the pro player at the table, I think Nick Vertucci put it best when he said, I hate to say this, but I said it so it's true. Like, you're gonna probably get it all. Just get it slower. Don't be so greedy. Because if they can buy in with their comfortable and play the stakes they want, you're just going to get it a little slower in, in, in a form of multiple bullets. Garrett hasn't played a game in over six months, and he's still the top player at the Hustler livestream. He's played 53 games and won just over one and a half million. And after Friday's huge win, Mariano was just behind him with 1.1 million. And the only other guy to cross over $1 million hasn't played since August. So yeah, even though it's true that everyone's trying to make money, it feels like as the pro at the table, Garrett should be keeping in mind that if he's constantly dominating players at the game, it's just gonna make players less likely to come back or less likely to want him at the table. That being said, there is still games that Garrett can get into and it sounds extremely likely that we'll be seeing Garrett on a stream soon. We heard Garrett say that he will definitely 100% play at the Lodge sometime in the future after his daughter's born in April. And it sounds like he might even play at the bike in the next few months. If you guys enjoyed the video, make sure to hit the like button and stay tuned for the next one.